Hey, it's Justin Stone Diaz, and this is today's video blog entry for the Power of Meditation 28 Day Challenge that I'm participating in. Ah, right on cue. J Train. Murphy's Law. Whenever I start these videos, the J train um, comes by. So, um, yeah, each time those come by, we'll take a moment out. Um, yeah, so um, did the um, breath practice this morning and did a little bit of the malt walking meditation um, when I was out today. Um, yeah, I'm having a bit of a, a, a sinus um, headache. So, um, getting on the mat when I wasn't feeling well <clears throat> was a little bit of a chore um, but once I was actually um, seated in the posture and the meditation was going I'm not sure if the if it was the aspirin or the meditation but um, yeah I'm feeling a little bit better a little bit refreshed um, mainly from the meditation um, yeah but the whole discomfort thing while practicing um, I used to have a really big thing that I wouldn't practice when I was upset and I really tried to be, you know, not, I guess stoic or just not, you know, turn to the Dharma when I needed, when it was a drama. Um, <clears throat> so um, practicing when I'm not feeling well or when things aren't going well is, is something I need to work on. Um, I heard a great um, thing on This American Life last night. Um, it's on this week's podcast um, they had a section about letting things go and they had a section about a guy who um, has tinnitus which is ringing in the ears um, which I suffer from um, I've had it since I was um, an infant my parents had their um, speakers on either side of my crib um, so I hear a persistent ringing in my ear well there's two ringings there's one tone in each ear um, and I actually hear the dissonance between the two. Um, so hearing that um, podcast about it was really helpful um, because when I was meditating last night and this morning, um, it, it really showed me some stuff about awareness. Um, most of the time I don't notice the ringing, um, but when I talk about it or like right now, it's the most loud thing that I can hear. Um, but in last night while I was listening to the podcast, the ringing was was immense in my ears. And it just really pointed out to me about um, how my attention, depending on where it is, can completely change my experience of things. Um, I, I constantly hear a ringing, but it's just a matter of time, when, whether or not I'm perceiving it or I'm allowing it to um, affect me. Um, I once told a Tibetan Lama about it and he goes, oh, now you know how Kuan Yin feels. And I was like, Rinpoche, what do you mean? He goes, oh, Kuan Yin, you know the statues? You always see her sitting there listening, and she has a very serene face on. Well, the thing is, she can hear the world suffering. And so you're ringing. It's like the world's suffering. And so, yeah. So whenever I start you know, getting annoyed by the tinnitus, um, I just, I'm reminded of that story. Um, but the, I really recommend checking out the This American Life podcast this week. Um, the section on the um, guy with tinnitus and his daughter with hearing um, impairment is really interesting. And it just shows stuff, some interesting points about um, attention. Um, yeah, um, just started reading the section for week three. Um, I guess I'll try the audio meditation for that um, also tonight. Um, again, I'm having issues moving forward. I'm really comfortable um, with what we've got going now. Um, the breathing meditation every day and then two or three times a week doing the um, body scan and doing the um, other guided meditations that she has in the books. Um, so I'm um, just getting used to those. So moving on to something new is, um, yeah, enough said. Um, Again, I hope you're liking these videos. Um, if you have any comments, please um, get in touch with me below. Give me a thumbs up. And um, I will be up at Sharon's program at Menlo Mountain Retreat um, next weekend. 
working with your enemies with Robert Thurman. They're offering all these crazy discounts. So if money is an issue, um, call them. They're doing a bunch of need-based um, scholarships. So if you're in the Catskills area or in the New York area, um, look into it. Um, it's a great opportunity. See you online and um, see you on the map.